So in the water days position, we'll see the seven days a week across the bottom. To access the interval mode, with the first day of the week flashing, we'll simply hit the left arrow one time. You'll notice a large number appear in the top of the screen. That's the interval number. On interval, if we use the plus to go above two or three or four or five days, four days for example, it also gives us a days left feature. Days left will be how many more days before that four day interval starts in this example. So now we've got set up a four day interval and we want it to start tomorrow for example. So we'll use the right arrow, make the days left number flash and we'll use the plus to go up to say one day left. The zero day is the water day. The interval of four will never change. It'll water every four days, we know that. What will change is the days left. It'll count down from three, day two, day one, day zero, and zero is the water day, then it repeats back to three, two, one, zero. So we'll leave it on one day left, which means it'll water tomorrow. In our example, because we normally do yard work on Thursdays, We'll want to have the controller water every four days, but never on a Thursday. We do this by moving down to the day that we want to cancel and press the minus button to put a crossed out raindrop on top of Thursday.